Today is gardening day, it's Sunday, and we brought some plants uh, yesterday. These are the plants that I am going to plant today. Are some edible plants, like this is um, Balls Zucchini. And then this one is California Wonder. This is a green bell pepper. This one is um, Zucchini Gold. I can combine this two, the green and then the uh, yellow zucchini. And then this one is sunflower. I wonder where I'm going to plant the sunflower. And this is red bell pepper. We have some peppers. And we have peppers there too, like shishito. This is uh, purple bell pepper. What else? And then this one is padron pepper. We had this in Barcelona. So this is kind of like chisito, it's not spicy. So we have like four peppers. And then we have Italian parsley. And then, oh, this is another pepper too. So we have five peppers. This is Hungarian sweet pepper. So we have five peppers. I'm not sure where I'm going to plant them yet. And then we have this like six corn. This is white sweet corn. And then this one is bush leg beans oh, oh there's more pepper actually so we have six peppers this one is golden pepper so we have the green different colors we have the green red yellow padron and then the hungarian sweet i think hungarian sweet is orange and these are uh, petunias Petunias are, are pretty during summertime. So this is a this has different colors. This one is more of like the not common type. This is called uh, let me check. Pink Sky. This is called Pink Sky. This one is Amore, King of Hearts, and this is just a common one. This one is doesn't have any another common common petunia. That's it. I plant the I plant the azucchini first, I think, and then the beans. Oh, I forgot. Eggplant. This is Ichiban eggplant and then the zinnias. They come in different colors. It's a beautiful day to do some gardening. Look at the gorgeous flowers. It's so relaxing to listen to the birds sing. The morning song. You don't need to go to the park. You can just like, you know, go bird watching from here. Hope you can see the yellow belly. See? There are two of them. There are more birds flying. I've seen that uh, bird in Cabo. Morning, Josh. I have not decided where to plant the peppers yet. I'll plant the peppers first because we have three other peppers that we got from the tomato mania. I made six holes over there. I'm going to plant 
different varieties in the middle maybe three other varieties of eggplant or maybe okra by the way here's the look at this grapevine i need to harvest the new leaves there, there are a lot of leaves there's like leaves and then saute them or put them in soup they are delicious and then the other le the, the outer leaves once they are wider i make them into dolmas and we have a blueberry bush here too they're not ready yet like the other one but there are a lot of fruits as you can see like here cluster of fruits there and then over there I got a few questions in the past if I replace the uh, soil on the entire box when I plant new plants and then the answer is no. We don't want to waste those like you know soil. They are like uh, organic soil too. So what I do is just dig holes and then just replace the um, just add new soil here. So I plant like this. I plant like that then add soil here around it underneath it and then around it and that's it there's no need to replace the everything since they're just growing in this space anyway they're not going to the roots are not going to like, plus those are like I said like those are like good soil too the eggplants have been planted too now let's move on to the um, beans the pole beans i made this trellis five years ago and it was blown by the wind but i like this one so i'm going to try to like uh put this back together i can probably put some stick here like you see there's a trellis here and another trellis there i can probably put like some stick from here from from up here so they they crawl down on the other side it will provide like sort of a canopy too instead of growing on the other side i'll train them to like from here instead of growing go, growing up i'm going to have them crawl to this other trellis first let's remove this uh like weeds it's been raining so a lot of weeds it's good when you remove them when they're still little when they're like uh when they have like established roots it's like harder to remove them our gardeners also help us um, take care of these weeds they actually uprooted a lot this past week I think this is the mint the mint is growing all over the place now wooden sorrel they have beautiful flowers like yellow flowers i can uproot them here because i am growing them in the other parts of the garden too i dug six holes there now i'm going to plant this beans the what is the label the bush blue lake all six have been planted I just need to water them and then here I am going to plant those are arugula arugula and sugar snap peas I think the sugar snap peas oh my the sugar snap peas is on the apricot tree now the sugar snap peas are almost done but I'll leave them there for now and same thing with probably I'll put some of the this uh, arugula and this one i'm going to uproot to the broccoli so i can plant the zucchini here i just need to add more soil there 
and then here I'm going to plant the corn and that one I'm saving for the cucumber the trellis for the cucumber I need to fix here I'm going to plant the zucchinis this yellow zucchini and then the or yellow squash and then the balls zucchini I added more soil there and I'm using this one GNB Organic Harvest Supreme I planted the zucchinis there and then the corn and then the corn here now let's take a break to make breakfast I have another task to do here too I need to I just noticed that the plum tree is already on the roof so I need to cut off this branch there are some fruits too oh there are a lot of fruits actually I'm going to cut the ones that are on the fence and then this one Let's see those tiny fruits this one too So I just cut off this and branch. What is it, Josh? I've made an organic homemade brush. Can I see? Oh oh my. Wanna, this you want to feel it? Fennel, it's not so good. Can I see? Can I show, show it to me? Oh. <laughs> I can rub it and you can see. One second, one second. Okay, go rub. Let me smell. Oh, smells so good. This branch has her fruits, but they are. Oh, also there's no storage from here. You could also use this, this thing to make a bed. Yeah, but a lot of fruits, so it should be okay. Are there a lot of fruits? Yeah, there are fruits, so it should be okay. But this branch has like one, two, three, four, five. And this one has more too. And then what else? I'm going to cut those ones too that are on the fence. There are a lot Should of fruits left fibers? too. And then I'll show you these flowers. The purple one. This is in the front yard. They are beautiful, you see? On the other side is our front yard and we have bougainvillea there and other like uh, flowering plants. There, this one, and more here, and then more here. What yes. are you making, Josh? It's a brush. A brush? <laughs> nice. Oh, I just need to water this. New plants that we planted. Those are the tomatoes. Whoa. And they have tiny fruits already. Soon we will have tomatoes. These are the eggplant. Look at the hummingbird out there, just waiting for me to leave. There, it's that one blueberry. It's coming back again. It's on the peach tree right now. Oh, what? There you go, you see? I'm <laughs> going to harvest lemon for our dipping sauce. This is, ah, wait, that's a huge lemon. You see? Huge lemon. Homegrown lemon.